Well, high school football is just around the corner, and as local teams wrap up their summer practices, one local standout was able to make a decision on Saturday that means just a little bit more to the Morgantown community. The apple has never fallen far from the tree for the Bram family, with son Noah following in his father Rich's footsteps as a multi-sport standout at University High School. Now he's taking another stride in his old man's lineman size shoe prints. Over the weekend, the Hawks' standout linebacker and tight end pledged his verbal college commitment to West Virginia, just days after earning an offer at the Mountaineer 7-on-7 seven -seven camp. For Bram, the chance to stay in his hometown and run out of the tunnel onto the very same field that his father became an All-American on was a dream come true. Being able to be offered by WV is really special to me because my dad played there and it's like where I've always wanted to go. And then I chose to commit because I've been thinking about it for a long time. Like my goal was to get an offer, my goal was to play there. So I knew once I got that offer that I was ready to make the decision and play there. As a father and a coach, Rich Bram has been able to see his son grow into the standout athlete he's become today. But after taking the journey from University High to WVU and beyond to a career in the NFL once as a player, he knows his boy has some more work to do and he'll have to write his own story in the old golden blue. His path is not a lot different from my, mine. The only thing I was a walk on, you know, he's a scholarship player, but the thing is, you know, he has to make his own way. What I've done means nothing. Moving forward, he knows how much work he needs to put in and continue to work to get better every day. Watching over every step of the younger Bram's development has been university head coach John Kelly, who helped build his father into the player he would become at WVU during his first few years leading the Hawks. Now, over 30 years later, the second winningest active coach in the state of West Virginia has seen a mirror image of his most successful player sprout up right in front of his eyes on the turf there on Baker's Ridge. You know, him and his dad have a lot in common. I mean, I coached them both outside these lines. They are as nice and shy and humble as you can be. But once you get inside that white line, they're going to they're gonna rock your world. While Noah Bram's first chance to put the pads on for the Mountaineers is still a ways away, he sees the big picture on what it will mean to the city of Morgantown to see one of their own, the son of one of their best, sprint out onto the field at Milan Pushkar Stadium. When I was younger, I went to WV football games, and it's like, like as a little kid, you're always like, it, it's like they're like really cool, and they're like, you look up to them, and I just want to be that and give back to the community and allow them to look up to me. No matter what happens once he gets to WVU, Noah Bram's story is one about fathers and sons. And if he has anything to say about it, it's one that won't be coming to an end anytime soon.